so we did it we did the one thing we dreamed of doing that scared us the most we quit our jobs sold most of our belongings moved out of our home and hit the road full time in our teardrop We met up with our good friends and sisters for shenanigans and a proper send-off. Camping next to a stream means showers. And if you don't know what happens at 9 o'clock on a Saturday, then you are in for a real treat the next time you camp with these guys. We said our goodbyes and headed east. Decided to check off another one of our bucket list items by visiting Craters of the Moon National Monument. There are a total of 42 sites available at the campground among the lava formations. They are available on a first come, first serve basis, and they are $15 a night, unless you're in the early and late season when there's no water, then it's only $8. The landscape was pretty intriguing, however, we were not able to explore much as most of the trails were closed.
palms. There's a bus full of dogs, and every time we move, they bark at us. So we're not sure if we want to stay here or not. So yeah, between the wind and the barking dogs, we definitely didn't feel comfortable at Big Al's this time around. But the good news is we were able to secure a spot um, a day early at the campground in the Tetons. Stay tuned for part two of our adventure, where we explore Wyoming, Utah, and Colorado.